This is how to use amplifiers safely, okay? So I want to make sure that right away the amp is off and my main volume is down, okay? Then I'm going to plug in my guitar. I'm going to plug in my uh, guitar into the amp and I'm never going to grab the cable. I always grab the shielding up here, okay? <clears throat> then everything's plugged in. My volume's down. I might even turn the volume down on my guitar. Turn it on. Okay, then I bring the volume up to my guitar, maybe it depends on the room, but five to six, seven. Then I bring my volume up a little bit, and you can hear that buzz already. So I'm going to bring my volume back down until I get the, the volume that I need for whatever situation, if I'm practicing or if I'm playing. Now, to understand how this works is the amplifier obviously amplifies. It makes bigger the sound, but if I, if I go, I have this little channel selector right here. I can be clean, so it's very clean, and that volume is right here. And I can also control the volume there, here, and sometimes there will be something called a master volume. But if I want that uh, distorted sound, then I change to, it's oftentimes called drive, and now I get that, what well, I get this distorted sound. It's the um, signal that's actually multiplied by itself over and over and over again. I control that distortion sound by the gain, which actually operates also as a volume. So you can kind of hear that buzz. Now I have meaner distortion. You can hear it. But the volume also went up. So if I bring, the, if I bring more gain and more distortion, I got to bring the volume down. So these operate kind of opposite. The higher number, the distortion, the lower number of the volume. Okay? <clears throat> if I want a cleaner sound, but I, a little bit of distortion, but not as much, I turn the gain down, the volume up a little bit. Okay, so there's a little bit of distortion there. But now nah, I want to play rock. I want a little bit more. So the volume goes down, and I'm at about 12 o'clock right now. I still want more. Actually, to be honest, I kind of like that really distorted sound, so I bring it down. This sound. That's kind of really cool, right? Okay, I'm going to make another video on how to actually play power chords like that. But now I'm done. We're done practicing. i got to turn everything away. The first thing I do is I turn it off. Okay, and then I unplug again by grabbing the, um, the shielding of the jack. Same thing with the guitar. Um, always kind of keep your volumes down and then bring them up slowly so you don't hurt your hearing or you don't actually hurt the speaker. Any of those things, all right? Have fun. Electric guitar is awesome.